What's up, YouTube? We here back with another video. Lofty or Jason here. And um, before we get into this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And um, all right, this week we're basically just gonna talk about three main big purchases, kind of big purchases I made um, this week of my uh, 401k, not my 401k, of my uh, investing that I have been trying to keep track every week of, okay? <laughs> and if you guys wanna know what I've been doing for the last past couple weeks, uh, link will be down to like a little playlist of all my videos of every week of progress I guess which ones I get to um, But yeah, all right this week Walmart Helion and Dana or Dana however you want to pronounce it Walmart plus they just announced it. It's coming out July this month. Okay, Walmart is like a blue chip. It's 100% reliable even before this was announced, I would have eventually invested into it, but this pursued me to invest into Walmart Plus. Extreme, I mean, Walmart just in general, it faster than I intended to. Walmart Plus, if you guys don't know, is like an Amazon type of uh, e-commerce thing. So they do same day delivery if you place online for certain things, I'm assuming. That's all they put out and they put like a little picture on their thing that says Walmart Plus uh and that's pretty much it with like a bunch of pictures with it and that that's it that's all the information they gave but if it it's anything like amazon if you actually go look on their um website and amazon website they updated their website to look similar to amazon it's pretty fucking crazy um but uh helion okay helion is a new up-and-coming company i mean it's not new new it's been around for a couple years but they actually just confirmed that they're going to be converting into a, a stock like an actual stock like a ticker symbol they're gonna have they're buying out a company just like how nicola did uh back a couple weeks ago like how they bought out uh vts q or some bullshit like that and then their stock price went up through the roof i'm not only doing it to go on the hype train but if i was actually looking at it and i'm trying to become a uh, truck driver and uh they're actually like a tesla truck company okay so like essentially what they would do is like they're making parts or a brand new truck, but they're the cool thing about their company, they're making parts to make it a electric diesel trucks. Like, so it's not gonna be 100% electric, but it's gonna be able to take diesel, right? So, which is badass, honestly. And then, um, uh, they're uh, they've been a good company, and the, the ticker symbol company that they, they bought into, whatever tested out 200 other companies and then they declined 100 i mean 200 other companies and decided to pick helion due to the fact that they have their head on straight i guess they really enjoyed what they presented them and talked to them about because they picked them out of 200 companies which is pretty insane so that means they're they're gonna be doing some good shit and then you're like dana what the hell is dana or dana dana is uh a company that has won three years in a row of best um like they make a truck parts, suspensions, and stuff like that, that um, go hand in hand, kind of, with um, Helion, I'm uh, guessing, don't take my 100% advice for this, but um, I think they're going to have something to do with each other pretty good, because they've won three years with keeping up with technology, making products, and stuff like that, with cars, and trucks, and everything like that. So I think they're going to have a good play in it and their stock value is going to go up, honestly. Not a lot of people have been talking about it, but I think they're going to be pretty good together. But yeah, let's jump straight into my portfolio now. All right, what's up guys? We're here at my portfolio right here, as you can see. I'm just going to go through my dividends and what purchases and how much I purchased this week so far. Okay, so we're going to go right here from the second. Um... I actually got from right here the index fund S&P 500 Vanguard. I got 90 cents from them from a dividend I reversed. I reinvested it right here. And then I actually deposited $500 on the 9th to buy. Um, I bought f do, 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 how many shares? I bought 8.4 shares of Dana, Dana, however you want to pr pronounce it, for $11. And. Uh, $11.84 per share. Helion, they're not converted yet, so it came out to be this stock. The ticker symbol is HLSHLL, -L, and I bought, uh, 
3.6 uh, shares of it for $27 a piece. So I bought like $100 of that and then $100 of um, Dana. And then I bought $300 worth of Walmart. So it came out to 2.3 uh, 2.3 shares of Walmart I bought and then dividends I got from Philip Morris it's a, a tobacco company I got four dollars and sixty three uh, four dollars and sixty eight cents Jesus man I can't read and then obviously I just reinvert uh, re uh, reinvested it and then Bud Light I got five dollars and sixty seven cents and then I just obviously just re reinvested it it's still processing for me right there and then we're all caught up with the 13th we're just gonna jump into my portfolio right now. I actually passed 13,000, which is lit. I'm almost at 14. Probably next week I'll hit 14 for sure because when this stock market reopens up on Monday, today is Sunday, which is tomorrow, I'm kind of hoping by next week whenever I record the video that um, the values on a lot of my stocks go up because if you guys can tell right here on the right side, look, um, a lot of them are still like completely low, right? So like I'm just like some are going up slowly but surely uh, on a lot of them and then uh, a lot of them are still kind of low but a lot of them are in the middle so when it starts going up I'll get a higher return on this obviously but it's going to take a little while but I'm excited for it to be honest with you and then uh, right here we'll, um, we'll go on my individual account I have 9.5k in this account and uh, on Friday I was up a total of uh, $114 just in that day alone and then total I'm up on $968 and then I'm up with the 12% right there and then um, I had a question someone asked me what is F, -ca F cash it's just how much money you have in your account to buy it's like purchasing power on Robinhood that's basically what it is honestly with you uh, to be honest with you and then um, we can go I got I got Apple as a stock bud but right now it's neutral because I got paid the dividends and it hasn't processed through because it's the weekend obviously but I got bud I got 10 shares of bud four of Apple carnival I have 10 shares of carnival coca-cola the one that's uh, out in Arkansas I believe has th I have three shares uh, Cooper tire I have four uh, Dana, the new one that I actually got, I got 8.4, and I got them for a hundred and one dollars right now, and I put in a hundred dollars, so I'm up a dollar. <laughs> I'm up a dollar in that, and then um, my uh, mutual funds with Fidelity, I have 54 shares with this one. I'm up 215 dollars with this one. The IT service one, I bought 26, and I'm up 137. And then uh, this healthcare one that I bought into, and I didn't put too much money into this yet, but I put in uh, $30, and now it's currently sitting at 40. So got a little, got a little jump up there. Not bad, not bad. Um, we got uh, my last mutual fund. It's a um, retail one. I have 19 shares, and I got 105. My mutual funds are doing really, really good, to be honest with you. For the short time period that I've had them, they're actually doing really, really good. And then we got Gap here with 16 shares. I'm down $13 with them. We got IBM. I'm down $18 with them, and I bought five shares. But honestly, it's okay if I'm down with them because their their dividends are like insane. They paid me almost like I think it was like nine dollars their first time paying me with dividends, and I was like, holy shit! I'm I'm gonna invest into IBM like crazy. Their dividends return is insane, and it's like so good. I think they have like a 90 something uh dividend payout and then uh johnson and johnson i got four shares 18 dollars i'm up coca-cola the actual one i have 1.6 i need to buy more coca-cola i know uh that i haven't put into them as much as i actually want to that's probably what i'm gonna focus on coca-cola and ibm i'm probably gonna buy more of next week to be honest with you because i just like how they do and like how good their dividends are and then um Oops, my fault. Um, I got a uh, Realty right here for five shares, and then I'm down twenty dollars with them. Uh, PepsiCo, I have six shares. I'm down a dollar fifty, and then um, right here we got Philip Morris, the one that just paid me dividends. I got four four shares of them. I'm down only three dollars, and then we got Redwood Trust. 
I uh, bought 20 shares of them and I'm only down five dollars which is not bad and then here is uh, the SHLL ticker symbol of the future Helion that they pro I think their date said after the second quarter no the the end of the second quarter going into the beginning of the third quarter so I think that's the end of no 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 the end of the third quarter is September 30th so at the end of the third quarter I think they're switching over don't quote me on it but I think that's what they that they talked about and then we got AT&T right here we got 10 shares of AT&T I'm actually up four dollars with them target I bought one share and then I'm down nine dollars and then we got the S&P 500 I've had I only have 0.6 of a share I need to invest in this I want to start my 401k have an idea of my 401k I need to start doing uh, my second 401k don't get me wrong I already have another one I have one with my job and then uh, we got Walmart here the big purchase that I made well big <laughs> it was only $300 um, then uh, literally only having it for a day because I bought it Friday morning I got seven dollars from them back which is pretty good to be honest with you in one day uh, and then we got Exxon Mobil right here I got 11 shares and sixteen dollars profit all right guys we're here on my dividend tracker right here you guys can use it for free it's dividend uh, track your dividends .com and you guys can check how much you do I mean a stock pays you a month and their consecutive growth obviously right here we can see Walmart is right here to show you guys it's 45 years they've been growing as a dividend which is amazing they pay two dollars and sixteen cents per stock you have a year which is amazing and um uh this version that i have is sixteen dollars no i'm not partnered with them but you don't have to buy it they bunch of, they have a bunch of free tools here that you can track your dividend payments your portfolio alerts history your future value your upcoming dividends and di uh, dice hmm. Divert, ver, wow, guys, I can't speak. Divert, verification. Jesus, man, I cannot speak. <laughs> but um, here we got Dana, Dana, whatever you want to call it. It's uh, 40 cents a year with one stock, pretty high dividend um, yield. Their payout percentage is 13, which is pretty good. Their safety is a 71, and I forgot to show you guys. Walmart is a 99. Walmart is a 99. They're never going to, most likely, never going to stop paying dividends once again don't listen to me I'm not I'm only 20 years old I have no clue what I'm talking about do your homework I'm not a financial advisor all right guys I hope you guys enjoyed that video and I just like to switch on and off from my computer in the beginning and I like to talk to you guys like this and then go there in the middle and then come back at the end I don't know it feels better I feel like the video looks a lot better to be honest with you like that and if you guys enjoyed please leave a like comment down if you guys bought any new stocks or anything like that I want to know what you guys are doing too, like so we can talk about it honestly. Because I think it's I love to talk about stocks. Like I can literally talk with someone for hours about it. Like I don't know, it's just something I like to talk about. But yeah, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned until next week. See my updates. See what I'm doing. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed once again. See you guys in the next one. Peace. Mama love me so I can do no wrong. Mama in a trap so this our favorite song. I'm gonna get them racks, little baby. They so long. Sad I wasn't nothing but.